Welcome to another episode of I Wonder, Doctor. I want to talk about when someone is feeling emotionally and mentally at an absolute bottom, what to do. Because there comes a point with anxiety and depression, for example, where the very best thing in the world you can possibly do is reach out for help. You know, when you're in a severe state, it's tough to believe that help is even there or that you deserve it. You may have left a trail of tears back there, people that are not doing well at your hand. And it's a certain level of hopelessness can be part of what's going on for you. And yet, I know for certain that for those of you who will reach out, and millions have at that dire moment, and get the help, it can make a world of difference for you. And medically, it's very significant because when you're under duress, when your fight or flight biology is just raging for a long period of time, you get into hormonal and neurotransmitter depletions and imbalances that it makes everything harder. And the great news is, is there are psychiatrists and other physicians who understand this and have tools. Yes, medications, and I know that there are some of you who are adverse to taking medications. And I say if a medication is available to support you and help bring you back into the realm of safety so that you can then unwind the issues and heal them over time, buys you time and space, and you can navigate better in your work, in your relationships, or wherever you are, I love them as temporary helps and supports. You can do the heavy lifting, working with the emotions in mind, it'll get you there, but that basic support that helps you navigate is so crucial. And then for emotional and mental and life support, there's an army of therapists out there. Psychologists, social workers, counselors, and groups like Alcoholics Anonymous, for example. It's provided so much support for so many millions of human beings on this planet. And yes, you might be embarrassed or shy or feel like you just can't face it. But so many people, even at that state, have stepped forward and reached out and it took everything. And then who do you encounter? Good people, for the most part. And a lot of them have been there. And they know things about you. <laughs> Because number one, that's where they started. And number two, they walked out of that space so that they know that that's possible and they can give you the support that can help you do that. So really what I'm saying, if things are dire, really awful, reach out. You're a beneficial and amazing, important human being and everyone wants you to recover. Believe it or not, as hard as that might be to believe. And the support is there. Reach out. It'll take you there. Oh, great. Thanks. There are more videos in this series available in our weekly school. Click to join. It's free.